What's up everybody, Dust MTG from Hawaii with a bunch of collector boosters from Universes Beyond sets. I got, I believe all of them, starting from Lord of the Rings, uh, you know, not the special edition, and then going all the way up until the newest one. So I believe this is all the Universes Beyond sets. Um, you know, you see the Universes Beyond there. And um, Assassin's Creed, oh, potato camera, hello. Okay, a lot a lot going on in my background, but okay, hopefully we can do this. I know Sarah Angel's pretty awesome in the back, but um, yeah, let's, let's, oh, is it this face too? Damn. Okay, okay, well, potato camera, you're just gonna have to work overtime and make sure you get this right. Holy smokes. Let's just uh, turn that around. Does that, does that even do anything? Holy crap, okay, okay, okay. Is it, is it this one too? Yo, my amateurness is showing. Can I get into the back? I mean, a minute in. Okay, okay. So the universe is beyond. Um, this is going to be my first for a lot of the packs. I've only ever opened these two. Um, I've never opened the uh, Doctor Who Collector Booster, um, the Fallout one, and now this is my first Collector Booster of this. I've done a... Whoa. I think this is a good uncommon. I've done a bundle of this. Here we go. Oh, these foils are pretty nice. This one's okay. This one's I. Oh, it comes with etched foil etched. Wow, that's a pretty decent uh, uncommon there with uh, the island walk. Okay. Oh, yeah. These full art lands are pretty awesome. Here we go. First rare spear of Leonidas. That's a pretty dope one. Um, yeah. I'm pretty sure that's like a unique new card. Another rare. Desynchronization. Wow. Did I actually pronounce that? Amazing. Okay. Another rare cover of Darkness. Um, I think that's a reprint. Maybe. And last card is a rare. Another foil etched. So pretty cool. A bunch of assassins to go in on. And um, a nice token out the back. Okay. <clears throat> I'm super excited for this one. Uh, I just, when this set came out and I seen the prices, um, I just expected myself to never open one of these. And, um, you know, a lot of these packs, I seen them at a good price. So I just figured uh, I'll accumulate them eventually. And, um, you know, oh, 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 I want to open it a little bit nice. You know, like this is literally the only Fallout collective booster pack that i'm ever gonna open maybe not ever i'd like to open another one but there we go okay Whew. um what am i looking at here okay am I, is this is this right okay oh straight away actually i don't even know how these packs the pack order goes but prairie stream um i, I don't even know how i'm doing piles right now okay I think this is worth something. Yo, I'm so excited. I'm like breathing super hard. My bad. <laughs> I'm just like breathing through my mouth. Jeez. Okay. Um, I know these foils are going to smell different, but I got to. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's just the regular um, collector booster foil smell. Junk Town. I will take all the lands, all the Fallout lands. I know there's a lot. Okay. Okay. So commons and yes, um, in the land, you know, still land nesting grounds. Holy crap. How, what's the pack order of this? I haven't seen any collector booster openings, you know, it's just, I just look at the cards. Oh, snap. Um, human rogue. Okay. This is an extended art, non foily one. So many rares, yo. Okay. Temple of abandon. Um, cool artwork though. All right. Yeah. I'm, I, I'm not like a super huge fallout fan. So I don't know everything, but I I just know they did a really good job um, emulating Fallout into the magic world. I'm getting like all lands. I'm not really mad about it because Glacial Fortress, this is a nice full art foil. And, um, you know, not a bad tap land. Not a bad one. So many rares. Oh, snap. Okay. Surge foil. Um, this is, oh, I love tree folks. I'm a, I'm a green player by heart um definitely something i would play um tree folk mutant holy smokes this looks cool 
Is this a original Fallout card? Because if it is, I'm pretty stoked. Oh, another. Oh, Mystic Forge. Oh, dang. It's just a table. <laughs> um, still, really good card, Mystic Forge. Okay, um, hold on. Okay, okay, okay. Let me just... This is kind of a mythic pile, right? Okay, what's... Oh, we're still going with the Surge Foils. Um, three dog... I got like four cards, three cards left. <clears throat> News DJ. Pretty awesome with the Surge Foil. Okay, keeping it going. Do I get a Borderless? A mythic! Oh, snap. Oh, snap. It's not a creature. <laughs> oh, damn. Um, I'm trying my best not to swear. I, I typically swear, but I love Crucible of Worlds. And um, getting the this dude, you know, the, the pit boy or whatever they call it. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, okay, okay. This was the hit, right? This was like the huge hit. But still, Crucible of Worlds. Holy smokes. I want to display that. Oh, snap. Okay, okay. And nice Nuka Cola stuff. Okay. Wow, that was a that was a really good pack. Um it was just so many rares. Holy crap, is that why those things are super expensive? Um moving on. <clears throat> wow, I am just so taken back right now. There's just so much going on. There you go, there's the specs and yes, um serialized, y'all. Serialized cards. Does the um the Assassin's Creed boosters have serialized too? Let me, let me take a look. Um, holy smokes. Yes, they do. Wow, all of these sets have serialized. That's pretty wild. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. <clears throat> let me let me get this open. Um, if, if, if I can, please open. Okay, okay. There it is. There it is. Open it nice, nice and steady. Okay, we're going in. Is this similar to, uh, did they make the Fallout boosters and this similar? I'm guessing so, but I like the um, Surge Foil land, okay? All right, Fifth Doctor, nice. I bought all the Commander decks, so I bought it as a set. So yeah, I'm pretty sure <clears throat> I have all these cards. I'm just looking for like the special treatment ones. But definitely um, one of the funner Commander deck sets just because, I don't know, I, I just think it's pretty awesome. Wow, crazy artwork. Crazy artwork. And, yeah, yeah, if you know Doctor Who, here we go, River of Tears, land. If you know Doctor Who, they did a super good job emulating this. Fourth Doctor, this is one of the commanders. And I got it as an extended art foil, so not bad. Okay, moving on, Temple Plenty. Yep, okay. Oh, oh, I like the Daleks. Them Daleks, and it's a Surge Foil. I can switch out the, the actual card in the Commander deck for this one. Farewell. Wow. Um, isn't this... This card is pretty good, right? Oh, snap. I haven't, I haven't like, been keeping up with these, at least. Oh, this is a nice one. I just like the art, because it's, it's so, it's so cool. The, the background is a desert, right? And then they're going into whatever. Too bad there's no, um... Flavor text here. Okay, okay. Coming on on the end. R. Just for rare. I was like, R. For rare. Third Doctor. And that is it. Got K9 Mark 1. Surge Foils Showcase Shininess. Wow. Okay. Nothing crazy in that pack. Um, But let's, let's get into what I really, really have been waiting for. I mean, the Fallout one was also a treat, but holy smokes. Yeah, um, oh, specs, 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 just really quick. I know it's been a while. This is like old and forgotten, right? I mean, no, like even, even Assassin's Creed is just old and forgotten. <laughs> like it was just the last set, honestly, before Bloomborough. But that is the Magic community and uh, Wizards. They just pump out sets and just, hey, forgotten about the old ones. So um normal collector booster style right i mean all the juice is going to be in the back so um maybe we can get a nazgul for an uncommon um smell test 
Yeah, you know, honestly, all the collector boosters, um, the universes beyond, I guess they smell the same, you know, came on the spa same time traveling spaceship, whatever. That was a bad joke. Anyways, okay, okay, here we go. <clears throat> Whew. Okay, first one is rare. Ooh, raise the palisade. Mm. Okay, yeah, that's a commander one. Another rare, Elven Chorus. Wow, this looks pretty good. And I like elves, so this is, and you don't, you know, it's not just a tribal one. Rare! Oh, okay. This is uh, one of them uh, scene cards, so I already got this, I know. Rare! Oh, oh, come on. Did I get this already? I think I opened like three of these packs, three or maybe five on my channel, and um, yeah. Uh, okay, uncommon. Okay. And for the last, a mythic! Oh, Theoden! Just a Kenrith, the Return King, you know, back from uh, Throne of Eldrain. But definitely not a bad one. Um, <laughs> okay, okay, nothing crazy in that box, uh, that pack. Ah, oh, shucks. This is making me want to, like, open more of those packs. Um, prices, prices. So, so the price I got on this was a little bit over 40 so I'd say a pretty good deal. And, you know, this is all eBay stuff. And, you know, people say, oh, don't buy single packs on online. I don't know. I've I've had good luck, and I've had normal, regular bad luck like this, uh, or just normal luck. Um, I have, in the past, pulled a Galaxy Shockland from Infinity in a loose, um, you know, just singly bought, uh, what you call, <clears throat> Infinity pack. I'm trying not to, like, bend the cards when I do that holy smokes come on man but last pack um this is this was fun this was um something i just kind of brewed up in my head like oh yeah it would be fun to open all the universes beyond sets um especially since i've been wanting to open up just a, just get another taste of the um get another taste of the lord of the rings stuff you know um i have a few lord of the rings videos um the collector booster box of the original um was like my second video i ever posted and um that was i opened it before the one of one ring um was pulled so you know the the chase was real the chase for uh willy wonka's factory was real okay so oh man i'm a huge lord of the rings fan and all of these just yeah yeah they mean something to me right now okay all right, so heading into it, um, there's I, I I don't think I think I already missed the slot for ooh nice Rivendell legendary land I got a lot of these already but um, I think I already missed the slot for whatever um, you know really crazy Elven language cards I think but um, and I'm not sure about any other serialized so we're just looking at cards now. Hoping for some craziness, Gimli. Okay, Aragorn. I used to just call it Aragon. I don't know. I I, I didn't know there was an R. Can t can you tell? I I didn't read the books. <laughs> just watch the movies. And uncommon. So many common uncommons. And for the last one, thank you everybody for tuning in. We got a mythic, just a Sam loyal attendant from the commander. Ooh, anticlimactic. <laughs> But nonetheless, this was really fun. Um, Crucible of Worlds, that was that was pretty awesome. Um, I, I kind of had a feeling I wasn't going to pull much value here. Um, so here's the Assassin's Creed stuff. Pretty awesome. I'll, I'll zip through these um, as I talk a little bit about this Universes Beyond stuff, okay? Because, I don't know, I, I, I do think it's pretty interesting, um, these cards. Like, are they going to reprint them? Is it forever going to be... A universe is beyond stuff or, or they're just gonna make like secret layers of them I, I don't even know like i feel like they could totally um wow this is a really nice card actually i feel like they could totally make you know reprint of of these um whatever's you know and then just like rename them or something or or just reprint a universe is beyond set um that is compiled of all of these sets together you know kind of like what i'm going through right now just 
but it's gonna be in one set and not like different sets i don't know how they're gonna do that that sounds pretty crazy it sounds like some mystery booster action which by the way mystery booster excuse me mystery booster 2 is like you know something i'm interested in i remember the first one the retail edition when mystery booster came out with the retail edition um i was so interested in it and i wanted to draft it and all that stuff but that was like in pandemic 2020 and all that craziness you know but um anyways and not not trying to ramble and make this video any longer um pretty stoked about this i know it's not a foil but it is a crucible worlds nonetheless just from fallout um look for more random stuff because i might pick up more of these fallout packs like this these are this was fun to open i think out of all of them i have had the most fun pulling this one um for sure and then i don't know i i had my fill of lord of the rings it's a night it was a nice treat but pulling like some cars i just i'm reminded of my luck you know doctor who yeah i got the commander decks you know it is what it is assassin's creed maybe if the pa if, if the you know the cost goes down i would probably pick these up maybe I, i'm interested in a few more of this but right on everybody thanks for tuning in take care of yourself take care of others aloha peace